I'm the Easter Bunny, bitch. Days like this, I want to drive away. Then maybe my gym stalker will stop following me. It's official. I have a stalker at the gym. What the hell? Guess who's eating good tonight, though? Yeah. This is my first vlog. Hey. Hey, like, first official vlog. Probably rant. Not sure what to call it yet. First, let me shout out to all the funny believers that decided to dislike my last video, my outfit of the day for Easter, because I called Justin Bieber an asshole. Get over it. Believers are mad because I called Justin Bieber an asshole within like 10 seconds of my last video. But if you listened past that 10 seconds, you would have heard me say I hate that I love him. People stop listening in 2012. I give up. Still haven't been able to paint my nails. Oh my gosh. Aren't these pretty? This is NYC Peaches and Cream, and this is NYC Lavender Cupcake. They're limited edition. Go on, go on, get you some. I have a stalker at the gym, and it is kind of creepy, kind of scary, hella crazy. This reject Tim Allen, hella old, hella wrinkly, Hello Odd decides to follow me around the gym, and this started last week, or I noticed it last week. He's kind of ruining like my whole gym experience. I can't believe this. Me, of all people, little old Sabrina has a gym stalker. How just life is not right right now. I need somebody to tell this gym stalker to get his life right, because I'm the wrong person to stop. You crazy? Motherfucker, I'm crazy. We gonna be crazy together? Come on now, come on now. Found out this motherfucker following me. He's been following me for since last Monday. It just ain't right, dude. Who follows people around the gym? Really? Every section I go, he goes. Every machine I'm on, he's across from. Fucker, get your life right. Just can't believe it. Like, I am in disbelief. This asshole took it so far as to where he waited for me outside the gym. As soon as I got in the parking lot, he turned around and was like, Sabrina. Creepy. First off, how do you know my name? After he turned around and said Sabrina, I was like, oh, uh, don't, don't see my friend out here. Well, gotta go. Went inside and asked for security. <laughs> security! And today, it's a whole other week. It's Monday. Fucking jerk is still at it. This motherfucker is over there. I'm in cycling class, working my ass off, you know. I'm on my bike. I'm doing it big. Dying. I'm so happy none of my Twitter followers um, go to my gym because I be having a struggle face. I be in that gym like, you know, on my bike or on the Stairmaster struggling. Today, while I was in cycle class, I didn't notice him. I don't know how long he was there, but in the last few minutes, I looked across from me outside the window. This fucker is sitting on a machine. A machine that you're supposed to be lifting weights with? Oh no, no, no. He wasn't working out at all. He was just sitting there, staring. Fucker, don't watch me. Watch TV. Learn something. And watch everybody else lifting weights. Why you not watch me? Huh? I'm not even that all. I'm... Honestly, I'm not all that at all. Like, look at me. Come on. There's nothing to see here. Nothing at all. This whole stalker situation has me really pissed. Like, really, really pissed. And he had me all the way fucked up today when I... You're staring at me for over 30 minutes and you're not even working out and there's nothing I can do? Don't worry y'all, I told the people that work at the gym about him. All they can do is have security escort me to and from outside. This is not life. This is not life. I've never had to deal with something like this before and it is pissing me off. Really? You're just gonna stalk me at a gym? I'm gross. I'm sweaty. I'm nasty. I'm trying to lose some calories here. What are you doing? I got my pepper spray though. It's cool. Like, he's just killing the whole gym experience. I finally found somewhere where I enjoy just working out and being by myself. And I can't do that shit anymore. People fucking shit up in 2012. I can't be happy. After watching some vlogs of mine, you guys are going to probably be like, that girl is ratchet. A little ratchet. Just a little bit. One day, I want to meet Britney Spears, and she and I are going to do ratchet things together. Hell yeah. Let go. Got bad bitches, they ratchet. Listen to E40's new song. It's not new, it's been out for hella long, but the remix is new with Chris Breezy, my boo. In my head, 
I'm just saying. Samoas, hella mad. They're not selling Girl Scout cookies anymore. I only have one box. I already finished one box, but I wasn't gonna say that because then that's gonna make me look hella fat. My friend E said that. What'd he say? He said, I'm the skinniest. What'd he say? Dang it. He thinks that I'm like, I'm the skinniest, fattest person he knows. Whatever. I'll be that. It's cool. Dude, these are the bestest cookies in the world. If you have not had one, you have not lived. We are here trying to function, function. That is totally the song of the day, though. This is me after the gym. All gross and yucky. Mm-hmm. You like it. I know. <laughs> Bye. Ooh.